Hi everybody, this is Funky Gag again. Hooray! Alright, today's video is gonna be a short video. Today's video, I'm gonna tell you guys, or maybe show you guys, how to fix your Streamlab OBS alert box not working. Solutions. Have you ever, one, ever wondered that when your viewers, your chat, your followers followed you, give you a subs, cheer you bits, and any other stuff, and your alert box is not working, it's not popping out, you're in the correct place. Today, I'm going to tell you guys how to do it. There's only three methods you can do. It's very simple. Just few minute videos. Watch till the end. And I hope this solution helps you. If this video helps to solve your problem, your alert box issue, remember to give a big thumbs up like on the videos and press the subscribe bell button to get notified when I upload the videos. And actually, it's for you and of course for me. And one more thing that I'm streaming on Twitch. If you want to check me out, check on my um amazing um alert box, everything. I will drop my links below, my Twitch link below, so that you can come and check me out, have fun, and watch some awesome gameplay. Alright, previously my alert box is not working also when I'm streaming. So I made a search on YouTube and see how to fix it. And I found a few ways and actually none of them actually helps me and to this video i'm gonna tell you guys how to do it and this actually um i i came up with my own and i hope it helps so stop talking i'll bring you there i'll show you my stream record by now all right so here we are this is my stream labs obs that i use to streams and also my uh my video recording everything so actually i found three methods that actually it can help so when your alert box is not working all right and i'm going to show the first method by now all right i hope that you um you can able to see here the, my mouse um cursor all right show bring up to the alert box and yep here we go so i place my alert box in the center right here this is my alert box um where the gif and and the text gonna be showing up right here okay so when you double click on it and you'll see all these alerts i'm not sure you can even look at it all right here you can see all the bits the subs follows hosts rates like stars everything's here so you want to make it um to toggle it on you have to toggle it this is going to be toggle off so whenever viewer is giving you bits or chats it won't shows up so you have to toggle it on all right so how do you actually do it the first method you can do first thing first you can test the widgets so let's say we test the follows and i'll show you right here all right so we, okay here so i'm gonna tap the follow all right so now you can see this is my my um allergy all right i'm gonna show you more unless you came to my streams and check it out yourself Aha. Uh -huh. okay so if that's this thing is showing up here all right it's working all right it's basically working all right and the second method is when you open up this alert box stuff that i tell you to um double click on the alert box all right and click on the source and you can see refresh cache of the current page all right i've done it so whenever it's not working you can just try to refresh it and nothing's gonna happen just refresh the cache everything so it shouldn't be a big issue okay click done and third then you can add your alert box by let me see uh, yep here essential can you see this is by widgets and this is standard i'm gonna tell you guys how to add as a browser source after this so you can just click on the alert box and create your own alert box everything so when you when you put up you add in your alert box and you're gonna show this thing you're gonna show up this and you're gonna set everything yourself the gif oh yeah your shot um sounds clip everything all right and now the third method i'm gonna show you guys what to do for the third method all right Third method, you gotta go to your streamlabs.com and log in with Twitch. As um anything Facebook, Twitch, I'm logging with my Twitch, alright? So basically, so how do you add as a browser source? It's very simple. Just go to the alert box on the left side. You see all widgets, alert box team, streams overlays. Just click on this and you'll see widget URL. You can even actually modify your your GIF, your sound script, everything by here as well. So everything when you modify it everything is done just click copy copy the url 
I'm not gonna just click to show. I do just copy this whole thing. All right. So when after you copy the browser source everything that the the URL there, you just click um add button here. You see my mouse moving here. Add button. Yeah, just click on it, and you'll see browser source on the left. You load the image on a standard. Just click browser source. Just add source. I'm gonna use a little broad testing because I'm just for testing purpose and just add source. Ah oh, no, sorry, I have uh, <clears throat> I've been doing it. So I'm gonna just cancel everything. Do one more time for you guys. Same thing, just add left side browser source, just add source. I'm gonna new source instead. I'm gonna put a test thing. All right, so just add source. All right, so whenever the URL that you copy, you have to paste it right here. Just just Control V on your keyboard. Just paste it. Click done. So whenever it's done, you'll see something alert box. I mean, any names that um you particularly want to type in your 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 name, like maybe you'll say your your fantasy alert box, everything. All right, so just up to you, and it'll show up here. So show up here because I I did not paste the URL. Because it's private, all right. So I'm gonna paste it. But after you paste it, you're gonna show here. So you can just test your widget by pressing anything of this on the left. Just test widget. Just just test is it working. So whenever it just came out, yep, and it is working. And of course, your Streamlabs you have to link with Twitch. Better you have to link it. Um, you you're gonna know how to do it on Streamlabs. If let's say that you want me to do it. I'll show you how to do it. It's pretty simple, pretty easy. And all right, one more last thing. One more last thing you have to remember. I found a lot of um YouTube videos that saying how to solve, but they never mention something very, very, very important about the alert box. Okay, for Streamlabs OBS, I'm not sure about OBS Studio, but I guess it's the same. So remember whatever source whatever alert that you want to show on the screen while streaming okay you got to look at here can you see on the down my mouse can you see my mouse here on the sources right here right so can you see my display and my game catcher is actually right on the below because whatever source whatever alert whatever a uh, sound alert that you want to show up on your streams you have to put it above display and game capture so how to move is very simple just 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 left click and hold just drag whatever you want to put so remember to put it above above display and game capture or else it not gonna works all right remember that all right that's all for today video all right everybody that's today video i hope it helps and it's very very simple just a very short video and of course if this video helps to solve your problem your issue give a very big thumbs up like on the video and catch me out on twitch so that we can interact with each other let's see how to play games you know some very awesome gameplay interact with each other i love to interact with my viewers my chats and drop me a comment to see um any other video that you wanted me to um to uploads to um to do everything i'll try to do for all of you all right any requests i'll try my best to do it thank you so much happy streaming everybody and happy grinding